I'm Michaela. And I'm Michaela's mom. And, and this, this is Cooking with the Cranberries. So today we are making fried rice, my mom's recipe. And of course, the first thing you need is uh, leftover rice. And some eggs. And the best part, bacon. And then we need some corn. And some peas. And of course, soy sauce. And salt and pepper for everything. Okay. Since we already cooked the rice and we're using leftover rice, the first thing we need to do is fry up the bacon. Bacon is a non-traditional ingredient for fried rice. I'm not really sure when my family started adding it in. In fact, Filipino recipes typically are um, garlic and rice, and that's about it. Uh, but you know what? Bacon's so good, I'm not going to question it. So now I'm going to put half a bag of corn and half a bag of peas into a colander in the sink to rinse it with warm water to let them defrost. And now we're going to crack and whisk the eggs to get them ready for scrambling. Now I'm going to scramble the eggs. Eggs are a traditional ingredient in fried rice and sometimes we'll add extra eggs and extra bacon and call it breakfast fried rice. Now I'm chopping up the bacon into bite-sized pieces. So now is the easiest part. All we do is combine everything. First you put the rice in the pan and you get it all heated up and kind of fry it. Um, I'll just use some kind of vegetable oil. My mom always used the bacon grease. I'll add a couple tablespoons of bacon grease for flavor, but can't quite take all the fat of all of the bacon grease. Um, we'll add soy sauce, we'll add the eggs, we'll add the peas and the corn, salt and pepper, and mix it all together till it's warm, and that's it. And you've got your fried rice. The best part about making fried rice is that it attracts a crowd and it feeds a crowd. Cheers! <laughs> 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 <laughs>